Hey guys, <clears throat> um, so I'm doing this video um, because I had a few emails. I was already on this uh, site before, um, and when I that was towards like the when everything was blowing up and it, this wasn't working properly. So it seems to be working properly now. Um, but I had quite a few emails from uh, Michael Yancey, um, from uh, Black Sun God, and and uh, Noticus. And I think he has a YouTube channel. I'm not positive, but so yeah, thank you to those guys for um, uh, re bringing my attention back to this page now, um, being that it's working. So now, what this video is going to show you is uh, on this website. I'm going to put the link to it in the description box. You enter in a routing number to a bank, and it'll tell you if the routing number is active or if it's not active. So, um, say for instance. Uh, you're doing a wire transfer or something along those lines um, from Federal Reserve to another bank. You need to check the routing number to see if it's going to accept ACH or um, or if it's even valid at this point. You'd plug that routing number in here, and it's going to spit out the information. So let's take uh, Federal Reserve Bank of Boston, for instance. Let's just double, you know, we'll just see, because we might want to transfer money from our, um, you know, our personal bank accounts or our business bank accounts. So why not, right? So let's plug that routing number is. There we go. Uh, is a valid bank routing number in MICR format. Okay. So Fed ACH routing. There we go. This is a Federal Reserve Bank. Change date 12-24-2015. Federal Reserve Bank of Boston. Funds transfer status eligible. Book entry securities transfer status eligible. So that tells us that. Look at that. Imagine that, guys. So now we have a tool. We have a tool to use for when we want to move money from our accounts. Get what I'm saying? Get what I'm saying? Get what I'm saying. <laughs> All right. Um, let's go down a little bit. Let's try another one here. Uh, I just kind of like using the Federal Reserve Banks just for uh, entertainment purposes, you know. So let's see here. Again, it's just for entertainment purposes. Um... Let's find a Federal Reserve Bank. Here, while I look for one, I'm going to pause you guys. So I decided, let's try out the Bureau of Public Debt one, just for, you know, entertainment purposes here. Plug that bad boy in there. Take a look. It's a valid bank routing number in MICR format. Now this one does not say that Oh yeah, okay. That that's uh Fed ACH, so it is. Let's see. It's active. Change date was July eighteenth, twenty seventeen. Wow, that's kinda interesting, huh? That's right around the time that we started using all these accounts. Hmm. Servicing Fed's main office. Right there. Okay. So we got the servicing feds main office right here. This is the routing number we plugged in. And they're valid routing numbers. Okay, guys. And then let's try one more. Hmm. We'll do the dispersing division. Is this the dispersing division? I think so. Again, for entertainment purposes, you know. Okay. So, this is the main routing number, as you can see, different from the Bureau of Public Debt. Okay. And yeah, it's an active routing number. So, um, this can be a very useful tool if we want to transfer money between, you know, our business accounts and our personal accounts and so on and so forth. So, uh, yeah, um, once I saw the site was actually working again, I figured it was uh, an important tool that you guys uh, really could use. So if you like what I'm doing, give me a thumbs up. Um, 
if you haven't already subscribed, I suggest to do so now as there's uh, probably about 100 videos um, just on this this whole account uh, situation on my channel alone. Um, leave me your thoughts in the comment in the comment section below and any ideas you might have. And uh, most importantly, share. Get this out. Get this out so that people can uh, can verify, you know, whether or not these accounts are, or these uh, routing numbers are valid because this is also a very important piece of evidence as well, um, especially for those ones that, you know, uh, I'm not going to go into it. But anyway, you guys can read between the lines. So, yeah, uh, thumbs up, share, subscribe, and comment. And uh, much love to you guys. God bless. And, uh, yeah, we got another tool to add to the chest. So, good stuff. And thanks to those, uh, those of you that emailed me to make me take a second look at this site. Much love, guys. Oh, and just one disclaimer at the end for you guys. I'm not condoning use of the accounts until we know exactly what's going on with everything. I just know that a lot of you are still on the hunt, and I thought this might uh, help you with gathering evidence. So, um, figured that would be useful for you guys. So, again, I'm not condoning using the accounts at this time. But as I find evidence and information, I'm going to put it out for you guys. All right? Much love.